Okay, gentlemen, you received instructions in the dressing room. I expect a good, clean fight. Protect yourselves at all times. Obey my commands at all times. Touch them up. And lovable guy back home, but there comes a moment, and you see it right here, where he flips that switch, and he gets hyper-focused, and as we said... You just said it. You know, he's going to take his time. He's on a box on the outside. Kavioskis is a power punch. That's exactly what he's doing, and he just took the jab downstairs on Crawford. You rarely ever see guys go to Crawford's body. He's still, they're not very quick. He doesn't really have a lot of creativity down low. More skilled than Kavioskis, but Kavioskis is more sturdy, far sturdier. Yes, fight. fast in that fight because the scouting report on Amir Khan was that he couldn't take a shot. So second right hand that I've seen from Kavioskis, you know, to be sitting back thinking, you know, he should, oh, Good exchange right that time, right hand came in when he landed the good right hand. That's right, Terrence Crawford going right into the wheelhouse of Kavayaskis. Kavayaskis is a short arm fighter, threw a nice little jab right there, and a beautiful right hand, and got Terrence Crawford's attention. Crawford coming out kind of... See, the patience of Kavayaskis is getting to Ter Terrence right now. He thought he was getting... Yeah, that, that can throw you off when you, you see a guy oh. who's always aggressive, and then I'll wrap your brain around that and make... Ooh. Oh, Kavayaskis comes forward! was hurt and the ruling that a slip but Kavayaskis came straight ahead yes. and it's the patience of Kavayaskis that's what's getting to him he must be smart a right Wait, hand no, from in the exchange we know Terrence is not afraid to exchange that's when Kavayaskis is time right hand pulling back with his hands down and now Crawford looks to exchange and pop a right hand and now Crawford goes to the body and look at the action we have here in round three as Kavayaskis another exchange this has done what he's done all fight he's timed Terrence coming in or when he's waiting he landed that shot right on the chin he hurt Terrence bad and I'm not sure why that wasn't called a knockout Joe here comes the right hand Another it's, shot over the top, and Terrence is posing. He's looking at Kavioskis as if he's not supposed to punch. Kavioskis came to win this fight. For the upset-minded title challenger and the pounds, Kavioskis is landing 42% as they exchange here. And Crawford's landing 30%. He had a 19-10 power connect edge through three. He's good. He recovered well. I didn't think it was a knockdown. All he needs to do is... Moments ago from Kavioskis. Remember, he's in that southpaw stance and the right... Boxing and then trying to come to him mid to late in the fight. I think Crawford's doing wait, 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 a little wait. bit too much too soon. Crawford right now is picking up the tempo. He sure is. Kids. He's willing to That's trade. Look at doing. this. Hands have now brought out the fight in Crawford. That's right. They are exchanging in the middle of the ring. Underdog, a great chance. Sweeping body Tan. Will this play out? But Crawford, who is used to dominating the competition now, and Andre Ward's scorecard has it two rounds apiece. But takes the first round, likely takes the. Is enjoying a 37 to 24 edge in punches landed. There are the power punch. I, I don't like this game plan right now from Crawford. He's fighting fire with fire. He's getting hit with shots. He's if you're Kavioskis, keep doing what you're doing. Kavioskis just got to let his hands go, Dre. That's all he got to do. Every time Crawford gets close, he needs to just let those bombs go. He's hurt right now. Kavioskis is hurt with that shot. And Bud senses it here. A minute to go in round five. Bud Crawford, here he is stepping to the challenger, who just moments ago was filled with hope. And now he's willing to come forward with a right hand. Crawford, he stiffed something out. He stiffed him out. He knows that he don't like the pressure. And combination comes in from Crawford. He has taken control here in this fifth round. Mm. He shakes that off. Ah. A knockdown. No doubt about it, guys. That was after the right hand from... Acceptable too, but I'm going to stay like this anyway. 
buddies, Ray. It was an excellent visit you had with him recently. I know he's got great respect for everything you've done in your career. Mm. Crawford got to be careful. Every time he shoots. Right now, he don't got, he don't got no rhythm. But it looked it look like he might be coming into it now. Is he emotional in this fight because he got tagged in that second round? No, 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 he's not. There's a combination. I just think I think he liked this competition. What about turning to the south to the from the south part to the orthodox stand? Once he feel it, he'll go to it. You're not asking him for it? No, uh uh. Once, oh, once he feel it, it, he'll go to it. Thank you very much, Bill Mike. Does that surprise you that the trainer is saying it's on the fighter? It is on the fighter, Joe, because I think they're telling Terrence the right things. They, they had a game plan, and I'm not sure this was the game plan, but sometimes as a fighter, you're stubborn. You just don't want to box. You want to fight. Tim, you know a little something about exactly. that. Listen, I know a little exactly. something about that, and that's what we're seeing from Crawford tonight. From Kaviaskis, if I do anything different. Look at that. Look at that. That's what you got to do right there. There's a left uppercut from Crawford. He steps right into that kitchen. He's smelling it now. He's he orthodox now. He smells the knockout. And now, as a righty, Crawford comes in. There's a three-punch combination from the chip. Oh, and Kabayaskis comes back and lands a combination. Oh. And Crawford just nails him. Twenty seconds remains, round number seven. Kavayaskis goes down. You want to fight? Here comes Bud. One of the best finishers in the boxing. Looking for the uppercut, straight right hand. Oh, he's got Kavayaskis hurt here. Looking to finish him here in the final seconds of round seven. Kavayaskis willing to trade. My, oh my, is that good stuff. Down scored in the seventh round. Yeah, yeah, this is attitude right here. Beautiful shot behind right. the ear from Terrence Crawford. He's willing his way to a knockout victory against Kavioskis. He took exception to being hurt. He feels like he's the number one fighter in the world. At seventh round, Terrence Crawford landed a fight high 23 power punches and threw 39. Let's see if he quickly gets back to that form and trainer say to him are you comfortable staying right-handed the answer is yes and that is how good work doubling up the left hand he's gonna explode here in just a few seconds well you can see him ready to snap with that jab there's that right hand that bud wants to land yeah but if bud starts at the body the head will be open he just did he had a sweeping left hand to the body and then came upstairs and now Kavayaskis right in the kitchen with a combination, including the left hand. Double right. He smiles and shakes it off and then goes with a four-punch combination. But all those shots are to the head. He needs to. Can't teach that. Kavayaskis got to let that right hand go. As soon as Terrence Crawford gets close, he needs to throw a right hand, a looping right hand. He needs to throw a shot at Crawford to back him up off of him. He's Crawford. throwing. He just ain't backing him up. Crawford very comfortable standing right in front, punching between punches. Every time Bud Crawford goes down to the body, when he starts to the body, it sets up the head shot. Nice right hand after going to the body first, starting with that body work. Crawford bought Kaviaskis right to him, sat inside. Kaviaskis got lazy with his chin on the platter. Crawford has a 50 to 38 edge in punches landed. Round number nine. Crawford took that last he, round off and... He's got a rhythm to him right yeah, now. Yeah, he's back. Oh, a lunging left hand. That backs up Kavioskis. Oh then an uppercut. An absolutely brilliant uppercut. Remember, he is in, one of the in. best closers in the business. Let's watch how he does it here. One punch, that's it. Bud Crawford, title defense. The time, 44 seconds of round number nine. Our referee in charge, Ricky Gonzalez, stops the contest. He is the winner by way of technical knockout. And still, the undefeated WBO welterweight champion of the world.
Terrence Bud Crawford.